Okay, we're back with Jim Galley. He's got her focused up. We'll be almost ready to rock and roll. Yep. We are. And you've calculated the exposure at a 250th of a second at f4.5. That's correct. Now, uh, wouldn't it be possible just to stop the lens down? No. Okay, no aperture on that lens. That's correct. And, it, and, and you broke the aperture out of it, why? And the reason I don't want to stop it down even if I had an aperture is because it's a soft focus lens. If I wanted a 16 inch sharp picture, I would just pick a 16 inch sharp lens. Okay. But this is a PNS lens, so how could it possibly be good even at stop down? Alright, film holders in. Film holders in, it's getting exciting. So I think, uh, not see any reason to not do like our friend Mr. Graves. Yeah, or was that uh, Mr. Uh, Clark? Turn that upside down, just make it easier on ourselves. Okay, so we're gonna... And, and, and we're gonna get a, a 40th of a second, you say? We're gonna get uh, two fiftieth of a second this time. Oh, oh, okay. And how are we gonna do this? Watch and learn. Here we go. We're, we're watching. I'm riveted to our seats. For our viewers at home. Start in a safe place. Okay. Lens blocked. We make our slit. And it's all in the wrist. It's all in the wrist. Are you ready? You ready? Yes. Okay, here goes. <sighs> One two fiftieth of a second. Wow, with Swiss precision, I might add. Dart slide in. And all you non believers will be seeing that picture posted on my website shortly. Oh, well, thank you for that. All right, now if we just go back here and we we get this here film holder, can we see the film holder, Mr. G? Certainly. Now, if you don't mind flipping that, if you don't mind pulling that dark side out and showing our viewers the photo. Okay. Watch. Here it comes. Here it comes. There it is. <laughs> 